Hello everyone, this is Cypher Deck, and today we're back in EverQuest Project 1999. I am on Flip Sides, and today we're going to be delving into the life of Aftermath. Today there was, or yesterday rather, there was an earthquake, and I was able to be a part of not all of it. I didn't have a VP key, I, I didn't have, um, or I don't have the health or equipment or levels to be able to do a lot of the TOV mobs. Uh, of course, I can do the ones that are are pretty easy, the West TOV, that kind of stuff. But whenever it comes to the big dog mobs, I can't even handle their AOEs. And if you don't have someone who's healing you, then it's just not it's just not going to to work out. And a lot of the groups that I was in was just pure DPS groups, so so that was kind of our our my uh, my little introduction. But it was fun. It was the first time I got to see what a hundred to two hundred people could do to mobs that feel unkillable at times to other guilds that I've been in. Like we killed King. Um, Killed the king in probably about two minutes, if that. It felt like it was much faster than that. That's kind of why the whole video is sped up, is because that's how I felt this whole day. It's just that from one mob to another mob, it was just all sped up. <laughs> it just, it just was. It didn't feel real. It didn't feel like EverQuest could be could be this way and and because it was and how organized everyone was whenever loot dropped it was just being taken care of as as soon as it could there were all uh there were other zones i was in that i didn't record like i was in fear we did uh two dracos and we did the uh did kazakh thul i thought that was pretty cool because i've just never fought him before uh, we took out two, maybe three of the golems. So we got a, we got some nice drops, and uh, it was just really cool to see that kind of stuff, um, and just see the bids and uh, well, it's it's closed bids, but just seeing how fast they take care of it. As, as soon as the gear is dropped, they're starting to to uh, do DKP for every single item that dropped so that they can scoop up the items and get out of there and get to the next mob. And it was really, really cool to see that. But yeah, I, I just wanted to do a video showing you guys some of the mobs we ended up killing. We killed the avatar of fear, um, pretty quick though, around 15%. I stopped seeing the mob's health go down, so I ended up turning my tech off because they said enraged, and I didn't see it. I didn't see the mob enraging. Um, I didn't. I saw the message, but I didn't see his hit points going down or anything along those lines. And then people started walking away as if he was dead, and so I ended up having to camp out. So uh, just really, really cool in that per uh, that perspective. But it's um. It's an interesting adventure, and I think I'm going to enjoy it a whole lot, especially after seeing this. Now, there are going to be lulls and downtimes, but those are times that I need to really work on getting levels. Just because of the fact that even with um, 131 MR, 120 poison resist, and about 110 cold resist... I still, um, I still get owned, uh, by the AOE, so definitely the gear will help, uh, that kind of stuff, so that's, that's what I'll be working on most, but anyway guys, hopefully you enjoyed, uh, this is Cypher Deck, peace out.